Hey friends, Doug Addis here, October 7th, 2021. And I'm doing a retake. We had some technical difficulty, but I'm doing a retake on this about this major prophetic word that you need to hear. Uh, and uh, I just released this October 7th, 2021, a powerful prophetic word. Uh, my Spirit Connection podcast, that's every Wednesday night, I do a prophetic word. Uh, it's a uh, first Wednesday of each month, I do a prophetic word for the month. And this, I tell you, I haven't had a powerful word like this in a while. And it's episode 201 called The Ancient Paths and Special Assignments. So, Lord, we just ask now, because there's such warfare, even even trying to do this broadcast uh, today, things went down and went crazy. And uh, the enemy does not want this to go out. We just say, Lord, your will be done. Open up the heavens now over the prophetic word and release this out to people in Jesus' name. Well, the word is called Ancient Paths and Special Assignments, and it's based on Jeremiah 6, 16, and 17. This is what the Lord says. Stand at the crossroads and look. Ask for the ancient paths Ask where the good way is and walk in it, and you'll find rest for your souls. I love this. Uh, Jeremiah 6.16, the Lord is opening the ancient paths for those who want to go deeper in intimacy and higher in spiritual revelation and understanding. And this is a season that's coming of rest. It, that's coming because that's in that verse about uh, Jeremiah 6.17. Uh, it's about talking about it. Stand at the crossroads and you'll you'll find rest for your souls. But the Lord's saying this. He says, listen, you need to step up right now and to battle to get into that rest. It's actually biblical. <laughs> Hebrews 4.11, uh, labor, therefore, to enter into the rest. And the Lord is calling people to step up right now and contend for the battle, even a fierce battle broke out when I tried to record this earlier. A fierce battle has broken out over this message and about uh, about what the Lord wants to do about this assignment over the next few months. But don't worry if you feel uh, overwhelmed, if you felt like you you know you can't go on the Lord. I'm releasing Isaiah 40, 31. But those who wait on the Lord will renew their strength. They will mount up on wings like eagles. They'll run and not grow weary. They'll walk and not be faint. The Lord is sending a new supernatural level of strength and a major impartation of refreshment right now. It's available to you. And also the part of Jeremiah 6.16 says, but you said, no, we will not walk in it based in, you know, the Lord was calling us to, calling people to look for the ancient path, look for the way and the good way and walk in it. But there was people who said no, according, uh, you know, to this. The Lord spoke to me. There was some people over the last few years have said no to their greater callings. But uh, in Jeremiah 6, 16 and 17, but we will not walk in it. The Lord said, I appoint watchmen over you and said, uh, said that, but you said, we will not listen. And the Lord is reconciling the kingdom right now. He's reconciling the gifts and the callings. Uh, so here's the deal with that. Uh, you know, the gifts are without repentance. We know that the gifts are irrevocable. Your gift stays with you. But your calling, your anointing, or the special assignments, those can be shifted. And the Lord has shifted this off of people who have not been using them years ago, uh, you know, and, and who laid down. Their, they still have their gifts. I want you to understand this. I explain this in the podcast. I go through biblically and show you that what the Lord's doing right now, especially this time of year, we just came out of the pan, uh, out of uh, Rosh Hashanah, Yom Kippur in September, the Jewish New Year. This is where the Lord opens up. Uh, he opens up things, uh, you know, the books, the assignments for the coming year come during this time. And so this year, the Lord said, I'm going to shift things for people. There's assignments that's going to come to you that others have said no to. Uh, and then... The other thing that's happening is we've had major damages happen because of the pandemic. Hebrews, uh, excuse me, Habakkuk 2.1, the watchmen have been under attack. I will stand at my watch and I will station myself at the ramparts and I will look 
to see what the Lord says to me and give answer to this. There is an urgent need. You've got to hear this. That's why I'm re-recording this. The urgent need to build up the intercession walls over the next few years, uh, few, excuse me, the next three months that will prepare us for what's coming in January. The Lord spoke to me that many people, the elderly, many mature, died during the pandemic and that the enemy used that to wipe out a great number of our prayer covering. These people were covering us. They were the, the Habakkuk too. They stood at their stations. It didn't matter if they could get up or not. There was many people who prayed from their bed. They prayed. These, this is a, a praying group that got taken out during the pandemic. Uh, but the Lord says that I'm calling right now people to an urgent three-month prayer assignment, whether you're an intercessor or not. Uh, he's calling people right now who might not call, think that, that they're intercessors, October, November, and December, and then into January, the Lord's going to be releasing something new. And so he's restoring the watchman calling. There's a whole group. Of, they had the Psalm 127 one anointing. This is a powerful calling. Unless the Lord builds the house. They labor in vain who build it. Unless the Lord guards the city, the watchmen stay awake in vain. This is the group that, that has been laboring, not in vain. They did not labor in vain. This is the watchmen who stayed awake uh, and who, uh, who were the ones who prayed and prayed and prayed. They cannot be replaced yet. Uh, since there's been a major shifting going on right now, the Lord says, I'm going to raise up the watchmen anointing. I'm preparing people right now to step into a place of prayer, whether you know, realize this or not. Now, you want to check out the full word because this is one of the more powerful ones I've had with a, uh, I'm a times and seasons prophetic person. So this is a, uh, you know, a time uh, where there's an assignment attached to it for the next three months. So it's episode 201, the ancient paths, special assignments. Lord, we activate this word. We ask even as I came under warfare, we've been under a lot of warfare over this. It's because the enemy does not want people to see this, does not want us to be able to step into the new. But the Lord says, my word will go forward. My assignments over you will go forward, says the Lord. And this is a time, Lord, we pray for the ancient past. We pray for the deeper things, the deeper revelation, and also that you would raise up people for this assignment, special assignment in Jesus' name. Amen. Well, also going on right now, I've been talking a lot about financial breakthrough because part of the prophetic word I got for the Jewish New Year back in September, it was, this is the Jewish New Year 5782, the two things, one was Psalm 57, one, which was stay under the shelter of his wings until the disaster uh, passes. So, that's part of it. Stay covered right now until it's passed. But the second part was Deuteronomy uh, 28, 12, that the Lord is restoring the storehouses. He wants to restore the financial storehouses. So last month in September, I did a special training on it, restoring the storehouses. But then we want to respond even further with this word and release now a special mentoring training. This is beyond just the what I've already done. I've, this is beyond the uh, training I've already been doing. This is the Kingdom Financial Solutions. It's a 49-day breakthrough mentoring experience. DougAddison.com forward slash solutions. Uh, and I will go through a seven weeks. That's the 49 days to change your life. And there's going to be two live meetings. Uh, one at the beginning, I get you going on a live uh, time. And then there's going to be another one uh, in there. And plus, we're adding two more. We're doing two more live meetings, a total of four. Plus, every Monday, you'll get a strategic mentoring video. And it's not just a video. You also get uh, the activation guide, and then you can go log into the private website. This is where it becomes powerful because we have my coaches are in there. I interact uh, you can interact with the other people so that you're not just getting a video class. You are truly getting a, a mentoring experience. Whereas, you know, we do the best we can with you. And plus, this is test driven. I ran this already earlier this year. We had a lot of people get financial breakthroughs. And 
So if you sign up now, it starts on Monday, October 11th, but if you sign up now, you'll be part of a drawing to receive a free 15-minute telephone breakthrough session with me. I no longer do these, but it's a free breakthrough session. In fact, two people are going to be picked. They're separate sessions, but two people will be picked if you sign up right away. And also, the, the price, I tell you, when a few, few years ago when I was doing the same style, I was doing the same style, it was over $1,000. I'm not kidding you because this is, this is mentoring stuff. But during the pandemic, I heard the Lord say to do 197 But then right now, uh, we're doing it for, for $97. It's less than $14 a week. My goodness. Uh, it, it's <laughs> it's going to be powerful. Plus, we'll also have the two-pay plan if you need it. Go to DougAddison.com forward slash solutions. I hope to see you there. And I really want to see a just see people get into a breakthrough and an understanding of what they're what God is calling uh, calling you to right now. So get ready for your breakthrough. See you next week.